Good morning, everyone. Uh, today is Tuesday. Um, I think it's October 12th, 11th or 12th. I started out my morning super late today. I actually took off of work from Tuesday to Friday. So I decided to just sleep in today because that's something I haven't done in probably months. So I woke up at about 10.30 today, um, about an hour ago, and then I just took a shower, put a little makeup on. Yeah, I'm about to get my day started here. Um, I wanted to do a quick show around of this upstairs apartment so far, since I haven't updated you in over a month now. So there's been a few big changes, and we are very close to being done. I actually have a tenant coming November 1st, which is why I've been so bad about vlogging. Um, it's honestly just been kind of like not as important to me right now because getting this place in shape um, that it needs to be is the top priority. So I will just do a quick show around. Please uh, note it is super messy here. So I'm sorry about that. But um, as you can see, I put this window up and fully secured it and everything. Um, and I just put the foam insulator on the side here and I just have to get a new trim piece from Home Depot. I was there yesterday but I didn't measure this so I'm gonna measure it and go back to pick that up. And then this window I have not finished yet so I just have to take it out, put some, uh, it's like it's like a sticker to help the moisture stay out and then um, refasten it in to the window. So there's that. Um, a big change is the floors. Um, if you recall in my last vlog and all the vlogs of me being in here, the floors were absolutely disastrous. They were horrible. So I refinished them all by myself, which I'm pretty proud of that because that's something that most people don't do. It's not perfect. As you can see, there's still some scratches, but it's so much better than it was that I really don't mind. And then here, this is one of the bedrooms. There's all my stuff in here, sorry. And then this one's even worse. There's This is where I'm sleeping. So um, yeah, the floors are done. The bathroom is in pretty good shape now. Um, I just switched out this light fixture from what it was before, which I think looks a lot better. And then um, I also put, I think you saw that I put this window in already, but I like finished it up, put the trim piece back on. And then this part was all rotted out. So I filled it in with wood filler and I'm still working on it cause it's not, you know, perfect yet. And I still have to paint over it again, but I'm just trying to fill it in to make it look normal again. And then here, when I bought the house, there was a big, hole right here where the tile was missing so I had to fix that using this cement board and then I retiled on top and I took tile that was from the downstairs bathroom to put up here because I thought it was exactly the same but as you can see the color is slightly different like it's not exactly the same so that kind of bothers me but it's okay I mean I can't make everything perfect in here, of course, so yeah. And then I also switched out these um, fittings. I know they're pretty ugly, but that's the only option we had. I think that's like the gist of what was done up here. The downstairs is a lot more like destroyed right now. And I'll show you that later. But yeah, um, you saw the floors too in the kitchen. That's basically all that we changed in here. And um, I don't know if you saw, but we got the new fridge and the stove is the same because it works just fine and it fits perfectly right in here. So um, yeah, good size. And then I actually really like these shelves here. So I'm going to keep them up for the tenant to use. They're nice to keep the pans and pots and stuff since it's kind of annoying to reach into cabinets to get things like that. Okay, so yeah, that's um, where we are at right now. So for me, I'm going to make some breakfast. I know it's already 11.30, but I haven't eaten yet. So I'm just gonna have some cereal, I think. Just keep it simple. It's 
So if you didn't see, you probably did. I have this puzzle here, which has been my like relaxing hobby right now. Even though this puzzle is not really that relaxing, um, it's just straight up a completely black puzzle. So there's no pictures or anything. So it's pretty hard, but I really, really like doing puzzles. I got this um, over the weekend, so I've made a little bit of progress since then. And this is just a fun way for me to, to wind down a little bit and to not focus on the house so much, but to do other things. Yeah, I've been very stressed lately. I'm not gonna lie to you. I think that my hair is falling out because it's just like, I, I normally shed a lot anyways, but it's been a lot more than usual. Like every time I take a shower, there's always like a lot in the drain that I have to take out. Sorry if that was gross. But yeah, I think it, it has to do with the stress that's going on here. So I think that once the tenant moves in, it won't be as bad because then I won't really be like on a time constraint. Basically, I have uh, my, well, my mom's boyfriend. So like basically like my stepdad is coming up this weekend to help. Um, he's been doing a lot of the kind of skilled labor that is required here. So he did the replumbing and uh, did some of the electrical stuff. So he is going to be helping with that downstairs. He is going to put in, well, he had me do make a prioritized list of things that I need to, to get done downstairs and what's most important. Um, so basically the most important thing is to get the upstairs done so that the tenant can move in and that there's no issues. It shouldn't require much on his part though to do that luckily so we're basically just hooking up a washer and dryer in the basement for them and um, yeah that's basically it so that shouldn't be too bad but then the other thing is we're going to be putting in the bathtub for um, so our bathtub downstairs and the toilet because basically those are the only two things that I really need in there to live there like it's not gonna be comfortable for a few months I'm sure if you know it's just those things but at least it'll be doable you know I could use the the tub as a sink basically for a little bit instead of having one in the kitchen and that's not really a huge deal for me because I already have all the appliances so I have the fridge the stove you know I have a microwave and toaster and all that stuff and that that'll be hooked up just fine so I really don't see any huge problem with that so as long as we can get that done this weekend I'll be happy. I bought kitchen cabinets a couple, actually it was about a month ago. I bought them from Ikea because they are very well priced and I always hear really great things about them. I just bought the cabinet frames from Ikea and I say frames because it's just basically the box. There's no doors and no dra like drawers and doors or shelves or anything like that coming. It's just the frames so that I can basically I didn't have all the money available to buy the whole kitchen right now without putting it on a credit card and I really didn't want to do that so I'm purchasing it in uh, like two or three separate orders so this first order I spent about $700 on this including the shipping which was $100 unfortunately to buy the cabinets and also with that order is my uh, the sink for the bathroom as well. So th those are kind of a necessity right now. So instead of waiting a few months or a few weeks or however long it takes to do the whole order, I'd rather just separate it. And um, yeah, so they are actually coming today. So I'm supposed to get a call half an hour before they show up, which is why I'm just kind of chilling out right now. Um, I have to go to Home Depot and pick up a bunch of stuff but I don't wanna do that and then get the phone call that they're here because sometimes the delivery people, they don't even call. They, they say they're going to and then they don't. So I'm just gonna wait until that happens. I'm gonna bring all the boxes upstairs and build them up here because the downstairs is just kinda of like, it's not cute right now and it's not really fun to be down there. So I'm just gonna do it up here. <sighs> so it's now, um, I think it's around 6 p.m. My phone's downstairs, so I have to go grab it. But my Ikea order just came finally. Um, I thought it'd come in the morning, but it just showed up. 
they left it all downstairs, which is fine. Oh, sorry, I'm out of breath. I just carried this thing in. This was this is a lot heavier than I thought it would be. So this is the bathroom vanity for downstairs. Let me just show you the rest of the boxes. I'm not gonna bring them all up here because I'm just gonna assemble some of them right now and then save the rest for later, which I can just do down here. Uh, these are the rest. These are all just the section cabinets. And here's the long like pantry one. I have to bring this up. This is the sink that goes with the bathroom like uh, vanity. Yeah, so this is the downstairs. This is where we're gonna be living in about two weeks. It's like super busted right now. So yeah, um, the wall is gone. I don't know if you remember. This is the exact same layout as upstairs. So this is uh, obviously the kitchen and the dining room. And I wanna make it more open concept. So we did this. Uh, we took the ceiling out and all the debris is mostly gone now. Thank God. I have to get rid of this and this. I have new appliances. Um, and then here's the bathroom. Completely gutted. It's uh, crazy. Um, yeah, putting new tile in maybe tomorrow. And uh, yep, that's how we're doing it. I'm going to try and cover this wall up tomorrow as well because this is asbestos and I just don't want to look at it anymore. It just freaks me out. So I'm going to cover that up. And then all our furniture is in this room for the moment. Um, and then this room, I'm currently working on taking the ceiling tiles down because they're hideous. And these wooden beam things that they put in here are very hard to take off. So I think I'm going to leave them and just put another very uh, thin layer of drywall in between because then it'll be easier to also put new lights up like the little really skinny um, can lights can fit there and I think that'll just work out better. But yeah, I did have these tiles tested and there's no asbestos so um, in case anyone's concerned because I know that a lot of ceiling tiles do have that. Here's our table that we had in our last apartment. And this is the floor tile that I got for the bathroom. It's like pretty large um, hexagon, just plain black tile. It's just coated in, um, there's just plastic wrap over it. But I only had, uh, they, they only had a few in stock. So I bought whatever they had. And then in two weeks, I think they're gonna have more. But I do wanna get started soon so that we can fit the toilet on. Here's our beautiful stove. I'm so excited. All of our appliances are Samsung. So we also bought the washer dryer set from there. And our fridge is from there too. We're going with a black stainless steel uh, look for everything. So this is also black stainless as well as the stove. So I'm just gonna bring this box up and then um, start assembling. I really love assembling IKEA stuff. I don't know, it's just, it's like therapeutic for me, but I find weird things therapeutic. I've never built one of these. This is what it is, the God Morgan, I guess. I don't know how to pronounce it, sorry. Okay, should be fun. So I think first you do the drawers. This is my progress so far. I built the frame and then this is the first drawer and then I have to build the second drawer too. Um, I think I'm gonna call it a night for the vlog. I'm just gonna keep working on this and then I might get onto one of the kitchen cabinets if I can get to it. So yeah, I think this is a good place to stop. I will try and vlog the rest of the week as well, but honestly, I'm not sure if that's going to happen. So 
please just comment down below if you have any questions. Um, I'd love to hear from you. I'm sorry again for not being active, um, but again, there's just so much going on here that it just doesn't really work at the moment. This is a fun little thing to do at night. It's kind of relaxing. I'm just watching something while I'm working here. And um, yep, so that's where we're at. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.